And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Well, it looks like the heavier snow showers, if you will, are tending to pull away, but we still have flurries around. And there'll be these flakes flying around here over the next few hours before they finally taper off and we get a little clearing tonight. Notice the back edge of any flurry action still here in central Illinois and just beyond that there's clearing going on. So so tend to get out of here, but still watch out for some slick spots during the evening and certainly overnight hours. Notice still a few of these flurries from Lafayette over to Frankfurt scattered about down to Frankfurt. You'll drive in and out of these if you're out and about this evening and additional ones up towards Rensselaer. A little band of perhaps a uh, the last of the heavier snow showers here near uh, Rowan, Mexico, and perhaps Royal Center here. Those are pulling out, though. And again, the trend will be for it to clear out and certainly tank temperature-wise tonight. Notice the readings headed for single digits. will be at 12 by midnight, 5 by 6 a.m., but the wind will stay up. So wind chills will be borderline wind chill advisory criteria, negative 16 by tomorrow morning. And that's where they're going to kind of hang out for at least the early morning hours before slow improvement moves in for the afternoon. Teens area wide right now, 17 Lafayette, Monticello, down to 14 at Frankfurt, 14 at Remington, and there are those colder wind chills working in. Notice wind chills dropping below zero in our northwest counties, and these will all overspread the viewing area with time as the evening wears on. So very cold weather, wind chills as low as minus 16 by early tomorrow morning, but then an Alberta clipper will pivot in tomorrow night, early Saturday morning with a one to two inch snow. I've upped that a little bit from the data last night. And then it looks like uh, rather than kind of a rain snow mix on Tuesday morning, it's trending a little more towards just some snow, but right now it doesn't look like very much. There's tomorrow morning at four, minus 16 wind chill again, 12 by noon, and we're headed for a high ride around 16 degrees. But notice the wind chill stays below zero for most of the day. Tonight, Low of zero at Morocco, actual air temperature. One Remington, four Lafayette, four Frankfurt, and five at Peru. Four at Linden and Romney, and only teens tomorrow area wide from 14 to about 18. 16 Lafayette, West Lafayette area. The warmer Saturday once the morning snow comes to an end. 30 Rochester, 32 Lafayette, 33 Covington. That will feel downright balmy. There are the clouds slowly pushing out of here with time for the overnight here, and that's what's going to allow the temperature to really drop. And there's the clipper off to our northwest that will pivot in and bring some snow by tomorrow night. So here we go. Again, we'll call tomorrow a partly cloudy day, but then we go overcast by tomorrow night. There's 3 a.m. the blue. There's the snow. Snow overspreads the area. There's 7 a.m., but notice how quickly it gets out of here. Just a quick burst of snow as we get into Saturday, and generally one to two inches expected area wide. We'll look at new data and see if we need to adjust that number for the 11 o'clock cast. 74 cast, balmy 32 Saturday. As the snow ends, 30 on Sunday, 40 Monday, perhaps a little bit of light snow as we get into early Tuesday morning. And the good thing is, you know, it's going to be 16 tomorrow, but the silver lining is it will rise tomorrow night. So 16 early tomorrow night, and then we'll rise to about 21 overnight. We're, we're trying to see. <laughs> I know you are, you're, <laughs> but you're doomed when you say 32 is balmy. I, I know, that's, <laughs> that's not a good sign. Yeah. All right, Chad, thanks. We try. Yeah, we I try. know you do. Yeah. Okay, Chad, okay. thank you. Yeah. Well, let's hope